What's up YouTube, this is Danny Savage coming up today with another video. So today I'm cutting a friend's hair and we're going to be doing one back and size taking it high and tight. So I'll walk you through that and uh, show you how it's done. So let's just uh, introduce my main man, Connor. He's the uh, Charlie Sheen of Minton and Norton. What's your, uh, what's your ASL mate? 24 Mel from Norton. Mel from Norton. So, I heard a couple of rumors, mate. Okay. <laughs> Just wonder if you could clarify them. Is it true uh, that since the start of 2K17, you've betted approximately 300 women? And men, yes. And men. So, you heard it here today. So, um, we should probably just get on and get on and do it really. Uh, I thought we were doing disconnected side parting, um, but Connor's like come in and fucking like fucked everything up, so now we're doing another haircut. We're going to do some slightly different. Cheers, mate. Right, so let's get started. We'll wash your hair, some water, and uh, go from there. Look at that, mate. That's it. Is that nice? How's your day at work been? Lovely, mate. How's yours? Good. Fuck. Oh, <laughs> <laughs> oh God. Don't tell Jack. What happened? Just fucking, <laughs> like, water's run fucking everywhere. Don't worry about it. You, um, going on holiday? Any time soon, mate? I'm going to Budapest from the British day. But I'm not actually interested in your answer. I'm just building in conversation. <laughs> so that's what you're supposed to do? Is that, um... Why is, why is that? Has it got anything to do with your penile reconstruction? Yeah, it's cheaper, man. I was wondering if I had anything to do with it. How much you paying, mate, for? 50 pounds. 50, 50 quid. <laughs> 50 quid. Pretty cheap out there. I feel this isn't going to be like many other barber instructional videos. Right. I don't watch people say it normally, it's just because just you're on camera. So it looks fair. Come on over, mate. Right then, so Connor's decided to have something pretty high and tight. Um, so we're going to go for a one. I always tend to go a grade above my destination. So we're going to go for a one back inside. So I'll start with a two as my base there, take that pretty high to fade the one underneath. Tend to find that gives you a nice, nice finish and it helps you with the, uh, the blending. So, we'll see how that goes. Right then. Ah, fuck. So that's the two done. So I'm gonna chuck in a one and a half underneath and then I'll do my one, so let's just, let's just do that. It's like a sunrise, it's like a universe. Alright, so chuck the one and a half underneath and I'm going to do my one. Can you not get my board spot on my head please? It's a bit late. Can you, mate. It's a bit late. Can you like fucking like fucking zoom in somewhere else? <laughs> Do you remember how like professional my old barber and village used to be? Mm. It's all fucked. It's all, <laughs> <gone down. laughs> it's all gone down here now. Right, clipper work done. Let's move on to the to the top. Do you want much off the top or are we just like giving it a tickle? Take the back off. Take the back off, it's fucking gone. No, no, just a patch of no that. Like a pitch version. Yeah. <laughs> you come in as old hell like this, and he's just a black man. So, um, I suggest. So yeah, I'll just like chip into it on top, a bit shorter through the back. We'll go, we'll go with that. Right. So, if I want to leave it longer at the front, I'm going to lift the fringe up and bring it back a bit, and that will increase the distance that the hair's got to travel, meaning it's longer at the front. So. Inhale. 
So I've removed most of the bulk. So now I'm gonna do a bit of the old scissor over comb to uh, blend it in. On, uh, on Connor's hair, because it is quite dark, I'm gonna section it a bit just to help me blend it. Brent, come and show him the section around this side. So all I'll do, just ever so slightly part it, and that helps. So this is the section that I'm gonna blend. So we'll just scissor over comb in the shit out of it at the moment. Good thing about scissor over comb is it does give you loads of texture. So a risk with a haircut like this is if you're a less skilled barber, let's say, you haven't got much room between the clippers and the hair on top to work with. So the blending, you've got to get it right. Otherwise, it's not gonna look very good. But luckily for uh, Charlie Sheen here, Got the fucking best barber in town, so no matter. Unless I fuck this up. <laughs> if I fuck this up, don't worry about it. I got a pretty good success rate though. I get like one in like 12 cuts right, so. And I've done at least five today, so I'm probably. Oh, I'm on target to, to get one right. <laughs> That's something. So we got a nice blend. Right, so. That's pretty much the clipper work done. As you can see, we've got some weight around here, which to be fair, in some other barber shops around there, apparently they just leave. Uh, but as it's just fucking Jack and Harry's and Danny Savage, there's no way. So we're gonna make this perfect. So I'm gonna use a bit of the old clipper over comb. Can you not get my ball spot, please? Mate. Can you walk around there, please? Scissor and comb, pretty much done. I'm just gonna run the thinning scissors through the hair because it's uh, pretty, pretty thick. So we'll do some line work now. Taper it in and neck, line up there a bit, make it look all, all nice. Fucking sweet. Let's just have a reach around, a walk around. Sure, <laughs> walk, walk around with the, with the cam. Brent, right, check the camera quick. Uh, thanks for watching. Do like comment, um, subscribe, share, uh, just fucking pimp it out, like, I'll probably do a few more barber videos, um, in the future, so, keep your eyes peeled, thanks, thanks, thanks. Yeah.